but this guy, Selatiro, says, Can I borrow a moment of your time, Marleya? The whelps have made such amazing progress while under your care. But as they grow, they will still require flight training. But with adventurers such as yourself popularizing racing, they simply refuse to start with the basics. As the whelps become ready for it, would you help supervise their flight training through these races? <laughs> I found some suitable locations around the Azeroth that will lend themselves to the whelps' natural abilities. But it would be unsafe to send them out on their own. Just let me know when you have the time, and I'm sure the whelps will love it. And there's no other option, but I didn't. I haven't spoken to him since he started doing the whelp stuff. So it means at some point, um, taking him out for racing training is going to happen. So that's cool. I like that. Anyway, let's see what we got. This is our new ruby one today. Aspects grace shine down on you. It is time to put my whelp tender training to good use. Um, a wealth of whelp snacks. May the flights protect you. I've done this one before. It's it's a daily. Continue this is serve. a new quest. Warm dragon fruit pie. Stand firm in your duty. When I think of red dragon comfort food, I immediately think of pies back at, Ruby, at the Ruby Life Pool. There were pies there? No one told me about the pies. You can always tell when our blacksmith, Crindisk, has downtime between orders. The entire mountain's smells of delicious baked dragon fruit. My pie, my pie may not be as good as this, but I am sure our ruby hatchling will love it. If you bring me the ingredients, I can make the best pie I can. Gather ripened dragon fruit near the ruby life pools and pre-made pie crust from Uragosa and Valdraken. Then bring them to Lesak to bake a pie for the ruby hatchling. Until we meet again. Making pie. She's, well, I don't know the gender yet, but I have a feeling they're going to be really, really snooty. But meanwhile, Ruziona has a, has a daily for me. Hi, Arleta. Hi, Arleta. This looks around nervously. I love her so much. Do you want to hide and seek with me? I think it would be very good training. I need to watch out for danger, so it's good to know where to hide. Will you help me practice? Find Ruzi and her friends in Valdraken. I've done this one before, too. But I don't care. I'm going to do it every single time. Don't follow me, okay? Okay. I'm not going to follow you. I mean, I can't really. And, and they're easy to find. They're marked. They're on your map, and they make noises when you get close. So I think this is not actually. They're all around the um, obsidian part, which. Yay, Gorgon Sormu. <laughs> what am I getting from? Get what I'm supposed to get. Um, Wheel of Wealth with Spurberry. That's the first item. It's not that they, you know, like they make it hard. I would suggest a cheese food to take home as well. But in all your visits, I sense you have m more pressing matters at hand. Um, well, let's see. What am I? I, I could pick up something. Some curting of Strathol. <laughs> oh, but way too much of it. You know, I'm gonna have a little. It's a quest item. Let's get some temporal parmesan, some mogu mozzarella, ice cream blue. I'm I personally am not a fan of blue cheese, but you know, Apexis of Asiago. Curting of Strathol. I have a lot enough curting of Strathol. Black Empire Burnout. And I get still at the Swiss yet? Yeah, I got. No, no, no. Alright, now I got cheese. All the cheeses. You're not gonna. You're not gonna tell me I don't buy cheese anymore. <laughs> Gorgon's Wormu. 
I mean, got all the cheeses. I mean, eat them too. Yum, yum, yum. Eating all my cheese. I like a cheese that materializes on my pasta head of schedule. Mogul Mozzarella, hailing from before the Pandaren Revolution, the cheese. It's a key component of ancient Ukraine. Stuffed lustrums. Stuffed lustrums is a food you can get in Pandaria. So, nice callback. Ice cream blue. Ripen in the frozen waste of Northrend. This wrathful cheese emanates an otherworldly chill. Mm hmm. Yum, yum, yum. All the cheeses right now. And then I'm going to sell them back. all the cheeses I don't think this I'm, I'm doing this with the idea maybe there's an maybe there's an achievement but I don't think so yeah there's no achievement I just ate a whole lot of cheese in this game it's determined can't tell me I didn't eat cheese Gorgon's or I'm selling my cheese I can't sell the the quest cheese though. I don't, that's uh, well, friend of the grumbles. All right, so now I need to get. Oh, we're doing hide and seek, right? Let's see what we can get. So another rift happening soon. The the Lich King one is just so messed up. I got credit for it for the achievement, but. I know where Rosianna is. I'm gonna go find her. I'll find her right away because I know exactly where she is. Is she hidden the same? Oh, she didn't hide in the same spot. Okay. I heard her, but. Oh, okay, they, they made it challenging. All right. <laughs> I l this is your whelping. Whelping is adorable does never knows how to hide always wants to look at stuff okay the other one who takes the hiding seriously is Rosiana. you can hear her when you get close it's too cute though the way she covers her eyes You found me. I need more practice. And I think there's one more left. To find. Last time I found one in here. I think I have an idea what I'm going to do after I do these dailies. I want to get one more rift in. Are you sure you like coffee more than tea? Oh, God. I like, oh, I didn't hide very well. We just got to talking. Okay, so I have to buy something. Not in here. Actually, I think I have to buy both of them at the um, roasted ram. I'm going to ponder a bit. Um, 
how like Valdraken has just kind of come to feel like well I guess you know like the new Dalaran um, if you've played anything with Dalaran as a, the, your hub which would have been Legion and uh, oh they oh I go to both of them Legion and um, Wrath Wrath of Lich King so at your service Arbos was not like that. Arbos was just so sterile. Pick up some crackers. My wares are old. My wares were made with knowledge. I need pre-made pie crust, which is a quest item. Come see me again. Obsidian obfuscation. I it should have just looking at the name of it. Um so I th bag of spicy pet snacks. I know where that is. I don't know what the dragon fruit is. That I have to throw a pitchfork at. I don't want to have to travel too far. I mean, so far these quests have remained relatively local. Where is it? I did this the other day too. Same exact quest. I kept thinking that she's actually that the pet pet dragon. The order is rather there. Incorporated more chilies. They may be spicy enough for Sir Pringley. And bag of spicy pet snacks. She gives you an indication that the two mildly let me mild let me know immediately. Will do. Um, so now where do I go for pet snacks placed? I need to find the dragon fruit. Where's the dragon fruit? Um, hmm. Oh, oh, it's by, yeah, right. He said it's by the um, movie life pools. Okay. So maybe we just fly there. Might be able to get there faster. So there is a an achievement to find all the lost stones in the Dragon Isles. I think I might make that my quest for tonight. Once I'm done with this and the Ian's Fringe Deli. And before I t start doing rifts, which I don't want to stream because they're so freaking laggy, it's obscene. So laggy. Okay. Yes. Yeah, oh, well, that's easy to find. I didn't even dismount to get them. I mean, it's going to annoy me if I don't put my poison on, so just. Why are these why do they make such a loud squishy noise? Is 
they actually look like dragon fruit? They kind of sort of resemble real dragon fruit. Alright, so I got the dragon fruit. Let's take a shortcut back. So yeah, I did everything I needed for the, the whelps today. And I'm just enjoying the heck out of, out of this very simple, relaxing little quest that is it's progress of a sort. <laughs> Do this part first. Give them it's snack time. It's snack time. There you go. Here's snacks. And they come running for the snacks. It's really cute. There you go. Come and get snacks. So you actually. Oh, cool. You can see that there's dragon fruits on there. Dragon fruits and what? Something that kind of looks like. A jackfruit and some cheese crackers because dragons like cheese and crackers. <laughs> All right, oh, let me go. We talked to you. Here we see Anna. Oh, cool. I get battle training stones. Um, you found all of us. I think I'm getting better at hiding. I cannot wait to play again. Uzi does a spin. This was super duper fun. We're gonna have the best time. I think she, I haven't. Oh, we're making pie for her, so maybe, maybe we'll finally get a name. I keep calling them her but until they haven't given the name. Luciano and is is a girl well thing. We'll find out. Battle training stones. Cool. Alright. Let's go make dragon fruit pie. We safeguard the idols. Aspects watch over you. Luckily, we are, we are not meant to eat the snacks ourselves. Just understand what the whelps want so we can provide that. Cheese and crackers are clearly what they desire. Honor all dragons. Thank you for bringing in more snacks. This will tide them over for now. Waters so then you get training stones and you get... Flight stone, so you mean you get stuff, you get stuff for it. Um, now I have to do the pie. Invalid target. The Isles have awakened. But he's right here. Ingredients brought to last tag. <laughs> what do you see? What do I miss? Until we meet again. I. Oh. Once more. <laughs> Clicking the wrong thing. Quest. I have brought the ingredients of warm dragon fruit pie. Exit. Give me a second here. There. Flame baked with love. Well, that's a good skill to have. So I guess I gotta Maybe give them. Can I give Ruzion a pie? Okay. We'll give Ruby Hatchling, who doesn't have a name yet, pie. I guess I could play with you. 
breakfast. Are you hungry? Oh, okay. Well, they like the pie. Welcome. It has been so long. <laughs> As I cracks his knuckles. It's been a while since I baked anything, but I'm confident. Stand firm in your come to taking care of red dragons. I know what I'm doing. I have a feeling he's going to mess up at some point. <laughs> Just a hunch. Continue to serve. Oh. You're playing wrong. A red hatchling seems to be having quite the trouble making friends. Anytime she tries to get one to play, it tends to end quickly. She can be a bit pushy, but whelps are whelps. You know, why don't you get her in the right mindset to play with some tag? Play with ruby hatchling. Okay. Waters nourish you. Valdrakin welcomes all. I'm playing with you now. Let's play. Great. I'm great at tech. You won't catch me. Why is there an arrow here? You're so boring. I didn't see you could move yet. Maybe you're so boring. Haven't you played this game before? Do you understand how to play yet? Maybe you should go over the rules again. That's not how you're supposed to play. I didn't see you can move yet. Listen. Hey, listen. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't see. I'm having that problem of the hatchling not moving. <laughs> oh, I gotta get her back to the nest. Okay. Aha! Okay, I see how it works. You have to veer them. Hmm, next time I'm the tagger. <sighs> the city stands true. Agapanthus sighs. I can already tell that Wolf is going to be quite the handful. Complete quest. The city awaits your return. We have done all we can for today, Arlea. Come back tomorrow if you can. I am certain we will have need of you. Okay. Long life to you. Oh, she's sitting now. She has a name. Okay. Bellastraza. One day I'm going to be just like Queen Alexstraza. She's sitting on her cushion. Bellastraza. Ah, who's the owners over here? They're so cute. I love them. I love them so much. Even though, even though she's a little snoot. Even though she's a little snoot. Alright. 
Time for the daily and syringe. I mean, it's 8.11. I could try to do the rip, but no. Let's, let's do and syringe. And then I'm going to do the stones thing. And then... I don't know how long it's going to take, but I'm, I'm not like... I found two in Zarelite Caverns are ready, so I'm going to just go to that, and then I'm going to go zone to zone. Find the one I don't... Well, I'm going to find all three in Zarelite Caverns. But I already technically have two already. So I'll have to tom tom them just... So you folks see where the stones are, because I don't remember... Re I only vaguely remember reading them. <laughs> The only one I remember is the one I read at the ossuary because I thought I was right about who the person was who wrote it, but I was wrong about the context. I thought it was part of the whole Blue Dragon quest line. Ran out of vigor. I hope they do explain these storm drakes at some point. Like, were they here the whole time? Did they ever leave the Dragon Isles? Because they definitely didn't fly off with, uh, get little well things. Who well, actually are not hostile. Yeah. Which is nice. Parents are hostile. Alright. Assorted fractals, okay. Alright. What have we got today? Hey. Oh, what what? I mean yes. Yes, it is uh, the one that I thought it was going to be, but uh, but usually you come in here and one of these folks has a has a quest for you. But nope, today there's someone who happens to be in the end that has a quest for you. And who is this person? I already know who it is because I did get that heads up about what the quest was. Um, Uh, Nathanos Maris. Yep, it, that Nathanos. <laughs> that Nathanos. Hi, I kill you. No, do I kill you? No, I don't kill you. You actually kick my ass, and then Taronda kills you. Well, I don't know. It depends on which time dying you, you mean. We have no idea. But anyway, just before all that. You can view Nuthanus in the game in, um, uh, I think it's Escape from Dernal Keep, where you have to help Thrall, who rides extremely slowly to, uh, his, to his, to his freedom. Um, you can go way off the quest and explore, um, South Shore. Uh, like, like ancient, not ancient, but like Shadow Shore many, many years ago. You know, like Nathanos is still alive. You, you see Tyrion Fordring. Yeah, I think Tyrion's, yeah, yeah. You see a bunch of like folks from that time. Anyway, Nathanos, Maris. And I think they, ha they have him in his earlier models um, set because that's an old set <laughs> he's wearing. But when you, like, if you had rolled um, Forsaken, Classic, a Lich King, before Legion, um, Nathanos was, like, your typical Forsaken in, like, these clothes. Then he got an upgrade in Legion. In fact, there's even a little thing you could say during a Zildjian's funeral along the lines of, why do you look different? And they go, don't ask. <laughs> There is a story written about why. He's actually now sporting the uh, 
body of his cousin. Who apparently looks the same. Anyway, Nathanos. I guess I should talk to you. He's not voice acted. None of these have been um, so far. There's no voice acting for them so far. Which is it, because I did want to hear uh, Piri, Piri's <laughs> voice. So good as Thanos. Um, foul beasts. I I'm not going to do, uh, try to imitate Thanos. I believe my time displacement was caused by the horrific creatures of the South. I can hear them even now with their monstrous noises. No doubt they ripped me from my original time just to taunt me. Slay them for me and for the safety of all good people in the world. Slay ten fell beasts in the winter pelt hollow in the in Azure Span. You're gonna send me all the way to the Azure Span to kill birds, Nathanos? Nathanos? Sure. Why not? I do wish there was a little voice. At least like responses, but there's really there really is no precedent for prior to uh becoming forsaken. Oh. oh, it's not that far apparently, I don't think. It's like right down here. Okay. It's like right on the border. I wish all the things I'm waiting for that. I'm waiting for the, all the things add on to be uh, updated. Because I know I'm missing some to all the squirrels, whatever's in this patch. I'm missing that. Aha, there we go. Oh, why did they get these to be there? Fell beast. It's just a. I need to get closer. It's just a duck, Nathanos. I don't have a target. They're rather, they're rather, uh, hardy ducks. I gotta kill ten of these, huh? Well. If I ever have to make the, uh, the food with the duck meat again, <laughs> I'll have, I'll have some mats for that. He's making me kill ducks. He's too far away. I hate killing animals that don't want to kill me. Bothers me very much, but I also want to get this done. I did uh, get my Turin Shaman up as far as she can get without Firelands recharging, <laughs> resetting um, on the Terragosa quest today. I also got it through LFR, and I will say this much, even though she did die, she died after um, Sarkareth died. Because there was a, a dot on her and she 
I couldn't I couldn't get the healing in and people already quitting at that point. It was like, yay, one loot gone. Um, but it went surprisingly well in LFR. I, I've noticed more folks are coming in knowing the fights. Um, no one dropped, no one, oh, they're just a happy little duck couple. I'm not going to kill them. Um, more and more people are coming in knowing the mechanics. No one dropped the two things. Oh, really? No one dropped the two circles on each other in Rashuk. Um, everyone knew to stand in a circle on Echo. Uh, yeah, it, 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 it went surprisingly well. It did get dicey at the end of Sarkarath. Um, but most people also knew about the meteors. They knew meteor placement was better. So LFR right now, I'm going to say, um, if you haven't done it and you're like afraid to go in or what have you, yeah, you're going to see people talking shit. It's what happens. There was a rogue berating the tanks about not swapping properly in a fight we had just won and someone said you're a rogue you're not a tank be quiet it's like and yeah that doesn't mean anything because that's could be i was gonna say off spec but rogues don't have off specs um they'll, they're all dps um but um i mean they don't have off specs like like let's say warrior is both dps and uh tank but you know they could also have a tank character this could be an alt and that probably is an alt but still it was still like why are you like when we win and people don't screw up the fight that's that's success all right i'm gonna let you too much we're gonna go back here and return this in all right thanos killed your birds for you you can be happy now the thanos <laughs> I want to just slap him. I don't like this place. Not enough cover. Too exposed. I'm eager to return home. My ranger general will be wondering where I have gone. Oh, whoa! Yes! You have a choice. You get to actually... To okay. You know what? The monsters you sent me to kill seemed like harmless ducks. Nonsense. That's just what they wanted you to think. I'm onto them, though, with their beady eyes and strangely shaped beaks. Can't even pretend to be disgusting birds properly. Monstrous beings of Eldritch origin. That's what they are. No doubt in my mind. Let's talk about something else. Nathanus, you're an idiot. <laughs> uh, step back, sir. Nathanos and I are talking. You've done this world a service, Nathanos. Nathanos shudders. No one should have to see such creatures in their lifetime. I can still hear their quacking now. I just... I just... I just wanted to add a slap command that you actually get to slap your target. and see it. Thank you for dealing with those monstrosities. I can finally head home. My danger general awaits. Yeah, you go do that. Say hello to Sylvanas for me. <laughs> All right. So, can I follow him back in and laugh at him? No? So, yeah. Uh, that's the daily there. I don't know why that's still over there, but um, eight twenty-six. I can aid you. Did you say I can aid you? No, it's cool. Time reveals all. Um. 
So, I mean, that's all really I can do here. <laughs> but that was cool. That was cool. Killing... What is this game with me doing duck murder? Um, anyway. I have unread mail. Please don't let... They should put a mailbox here, by the way. I'm like, please don't let it be from Nathanos. I don't want to be receiving messages from Nathanos. Right, I'm just going to take the headstone. Can't be stuff I forgot to loot. But I don't want I don't want to waste a Katie stamp whistle on that. I may want to pull her out later. And she's got like a ridiculous cooldown, so. Mike and Tony. You know <laughs> I I like when people name their pets. And I appreciate that Spider Surus. He's a hunter. Has one named Tony and one named Mike. I appreciate that. That's cool. Alright. Nope, just stuff that's sold. Auction house stuff. Alright. Put some stuff in the bank. And then we're gonna do some proper exploring. Proper finding of things. I'm, I don't even. I almost cursed myself by mentioning what I noticed I didn't have a lot of. Um, I have a lot of those feathers, and I. I don't know what they're used for. This. Okay, these are both raised level stuff. So I'm gonna go raise some levels and pets. Get those out of my bag. I'm gonna sell what I can sell. Yeah, there's a little bit of lag. I was little, like, I know I I did a video card upgrade. Everyone's walking around with the infinite freaking well, things. Uh, I gotta do that dungeon. I have many many wares. Find a grind. Find a group that's running it. Maybe it. Many farewells. Maybe I will try a pug. All right, let's, let's get this out. Um, pet turtle. <sighs> Dragonkin battle training stones. Let's let's look for a dragonkin. Aw. Ageless Bronze Drake. Bronze Drake. Alpina. Now I need one that's I wanna I wanna give it to one that is low level. There are none that low level. Here we go. Alright. Drax is cute. <laughs> Crimson Proto Whelp is also on. But let's see Drax is Drax is adorable. Look at him. I mean look at him. Look at him. Now he's, now he's level 17. Alright. He's got armor on. Look at him. He's got a little armor on. Alright. This is flying. So we're going to change our filter. And it's easier just off and just clear it. Go to flying. And then we'll change our level. Number one to seven. And Kona Chicken. Crow. I'm just trying to see if there's something that I know comes up as a often comes up in um as pet battle suggestions. I don't know, I like Yipper. 
give you a first these uh this boost. There. Adorable. Alright. So we're gonna go to Zarelic Caverns first. I'm not flying down. I'm, I'm going to take the scenic route. I'm going to go get a snack. For the glory of the dragons. Um, not sure where. In, so we'll just pick Loam. Loam is a good place, Sunny. I'll put myself on mute. You can hear flapping. Beans. All right. (laughs) 
So. Uh, if I'm still up for it, I may check out the uh, Nexramas stuff. Because there's a quest to get into Nexramas. To farm for old stuff. I haven't been there in a while. I mean, I was in there the other day for the um, Yon's Fringe thing. Yesterday, I think it was. You have to get a squeaky toy for Miss Mr. Bigglesworth. Um, let's see. Ancient Stones of Zarelec Caverns. <clears throat> We're just doing Tom Tom. <laughs> I'm not... Now, most of these I have already. There's only three in Sarah Lake Caverns. There's only three. A swarm of moths is drawing near the central beacon, blocking the light we use to navigate. That's cool. Mount up and knock them from the skies. It's very close. It's like right here. Oh, wait a minute. There's a backpack here. All right. Oh, here we go. It's right over here. Oh, <laughs> missed it. Yeah, I read this during the quest for Varaxian. For Varaxian. So they look like this. To witness the earth water shape the land and draw forth, forth the potent magma that will power his laboratory was inspiring to us all. The Jaradin seek to drive us out. But the dragon slayers stand alone and have no hope of victory. The master says a great war is coming, and that he alone can protect dragonkind. Until our queen can be convinced he is right, we must labor here in secret. By wing or by talon, we shall prevail. Ooh. Okay. This is related to the quest, but I'm, I'm not going to pick it up right now. I do have, have a copy of it already, I think. Um, eh, why not? I'll just look at it. I think you could just read it. No, you get a copy of it. Yeah, it's related to... Um, note to disposal site. This note contains orders sent to the gaze of Notharian. The official site for subject disposal is platform leaders. We have procedures for a reason. They should be followed. The Abrus overseers do not want to see disposal occur in other locations, regardless of how convenient they are. So it's... You know what happens in Abrus. You know, it's kind of like... Ugh. Anyway. So that's one. Which one was that? That was... Primal Power. So we're going to check out Binding Oaths. This one I think I remember someone that's by the, is near n that place that's hard to pronounce. Oh, research archers under fire is happening, but doing those of them this days. I don't think I've done this weeks. Yeah, I did. These I Titan devices were created to gather data and Sorry, monitor Renan. their environs. See what knowledge you can glean from them while they do their thing. Sorry, Renan. No can do today. Here it is. Well, at last, we breached these hidden halls. It's Nazkazol. Yeah, Nazkazol. 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 Oi. When at last we breached these hidden halls, the master was wroth. He remembered angry words about Tyr's many secrets. I judged it unwise to press him further. Then when we presented the artifact, we found his mood brightened. The ideal soldier never questions orders, he told us. 
The glove fits as though it had been made for him. Before long, the master returned to his experiments, heartened that he would soon succeed. This is where you go. With, um, Renan and crew and, um, Abyssian and Emberthal. Um, chasing Sarkareth and crew in there. And they find the, um, they find the broken, uh, glove of domination that you see in, in, you, you see it if you, if you watch the, um, uh, the cinematics for this expansion, the, uh, three, um, the one that shows the point at which Neltharion fell. He's wearing, there's a whole thing about it. I, I'm not going to go into it right now, but that's what that's referring to. All right. One more. Is there like ca caverns? I don't think this one, I don't think I have. This one is new. Um, it's called Demanding Perfection. Sorry. To hit. It's way at the other end. Huh. It's located here. I've been here a few times on other characters, including Arleia. To get, um, it's right here. To do the thing that opens up the chest in Abarus up here. If you kneel, it's not going to matter now because I already got it. But if you stand in front and you kneel. You'll see the eyes light up, and then it's going to breathe fire, or whatever the heck it is, obsidian dragons breathe, um, like some fire earth flame thing. But over here, I'm going to have to probably kill these guys. Yep. Is the stone. So what does the stone say? Ancient stones of Well, I, that's the achievement. But what does the stone say? Here we go. The master master detailed his specifications as always. He expected perfection. We labored ceaselessly. We slept little. But, but duty and fear kept us moving apace. Overseer Ketheros. Ketheros. That's a blue dragon was called before the master or it's it's hard to tell dragon dragon can have different names over to Ketheros was called before the master one of the passageways had been carved smaller than designed he was told there was fire and screaming then I was promoted to overseer I will measure each passageway myself the master will have his laboratory as designed and now I'll return home to my broodmate and our whelplings I wonder how that turned out for him. <laughs> um, that's also like going to the question of dragon society and broodmates and consorts and how that all works. Um, anyway, we're going to take a shortcut. Go back to Veldraken. So that's one. We got one. We got one down. I think Forbidden Reach has some. I may just do Forbidden Reach first.
It's a lot of little things to do. Um, here we go. Ancient Stones of the Dragon Isles. I'm going to put tracking for this. Um... can't tell what these say. Waking Shores, Onarum Plains, Azure Span, Valdrasis. Are there none forbidden reach? Maybe not. So let's start Valdrasis since we're here. How many are there? Oh, I have two already, but we're going to look at them anyway. There's one in Veldrakum. There's one in Veldrakum. Since we're here, let's find that one first. It's like right over here. <laughs> you know why? Where is it? There it is. Well, you know, I don't come up this way very often. I fly in, so it's hard to see. All right, so what's this say? My beloved kin, it is here we have built a monument to our unity. Veldraken stands not just as a home, but an example of what draconic ingenuity and cooperation can create. Every dragon has put their mark on this place through both the magic of their, through both the magic of their fight and their dedication to each other. From its heights, we can watch over the isle, isles and keep them under our care. We can gather and share what we have accomplished, ensuring that each new generation continues to grow and thrive. Veldraken is a place of harmony of balance, and of the love that unites us. As you walk its paths and speak with your kin, let that love guide you, let that love guide you. Together we flourish, Alex Oops. Can I clear the marker? Wow, it's... I'm trying to clear the mark. All right, just gonna clear it manually. Next one. Well, we're doing all of them, but I figured I was gonna do the one that's in Veldrak at first. The next closest one is Mighty Ducks. Now my cat has found a thing. Which is good. It's it's some foam thing um, that she's using as a scratching post, which is great. Because she's using that, she's not using furniture. All right. Mighty Ducks. That's right here. Is it underwater? Looks like it might be underwater. No. Oh, it looks like it's on this little island here. Okay. The noises this fish makes, it... <laughs> it's not a fish. Fish don't make noises like that. It sounds like some guy on re 
reaver and with the reverb turned away of going wee 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 <laughs> and I'm like <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's read this down. I came here to nap as off as I often do, and found myself confronted by a very angry duck. What is it with the duck hate in this expansion? <laughs> Upon closer inspection, it appears that she, I believe she is the mother, is guarding a clutch of eggs. After some soothing reassurances, she let me rest, but I found myself unable to doze off. Instead of observing the duck, the nest, and the eggs, she continued to watch me when she thought I was not looking, as if sizing me up. Despite her small stature, I believe she is more than capable of delivering a beating to anything that might threaten on our, our offspring. How very like a dragon. I suppose it matters little if an egg comes from a dragon or a duck. Fragile those shells may be. But they hatch into mighty creatures, no matter their size. Mighty ducks. Quack, quack. Cute little duck things. Little duck. They are adorable. D don't mind me. So, I'll clear this. Remove waypoint. Right. Next closes. Well, it's kind of all over the place so we'll start we'll go north and head south well we're close to the south a timely message this is going to take us to the bronze dragon flight area and then we'll work north Gonna be a longer trip. It's probably a message from the dark no stormy. Very close. Oh, it's right there. Okay. Let's see what it says. A timely message. Timely message. Okay. Coral Dormy. Oh, haha, very funny. Look, I'm certain you think it is a marvelous prank. But if someone of age, not of our own, finds those messages, they may learn of events and instances that should, they should not know about. Think about the temporal repercussions. You could be opening the way to, to paradox, and you know Father wouldn't be happy about that, would he? Also, it was my diary. I don't care when you took it. Bring it back. I want to know more about this story. <laughs> All right, that was fun. Next one is North. It was called Together Bound. They have mailboxes and yeah, they do. I need to I need to stop by and check check a mailbox. All right, onward.
Some of the beasties that came through the time rifts here ended up in bad places, like these poor wee kitties. Not doing the kitties. Go on and save them. Try and tell To be right here. Oh, great. Fell Lieutenant. I am clearly in a rift, I think. He promised. Alright. Sorry, he promised. I gotta read this tablet. I'm assuming they mean Illidan. Here we stand before. <laughs> I want to finish it without being attacked. Here we stand and here we gather beneath both wind and sky, joined as one forever, for one forever after, beheld by dragon eyes. Should any serve to break the bond that binds them strong and true, both tooth and claw of dragon kind shall dole them out their due. Soul to soul and heart to heart, they now live as on as one. Wing to wing, they take to skies. Their journey just begun. It sounds like, well, I mean, dragging wedding, dragon wedding vows. And it's a good spot. I, I've passed by the spot often too before, like fell things started showing up. Fell queen's guide. Fell. My guess is this is the. Uh, the future where the Legion won. Right. So, next one is Keeper's Blessing. I didn't realize. probably cheer hold. I didn't realize um, the rifts went out this far. But I guess so. Yeah, I mean, well, I'm right there, really. Not that far. Um, oh, come on, really? How many times I've been over here? right here. This isn't tear hold. It's why we forget killed you end up. To those who follow the Titan's path, no focus, no harmony. To those who honor the Titan's teachings, grant wisdom, grant strength. For those who fall from the Titan's grace, in the deep places we shall bind you. For those who betray the Titan's gifts will be broken and reforged anew. Titans are not good. <laughs> Titans are not good. Nothing's good. Uh, yeah. Okay. Right. I was trying to clear it by running over it, but let me move my point. Next one is Oh Guardian Wings. This one is by the Academy. I didn't I didn't get the code for it. Here's a fun little thing to do this evening, I think. A nice little quiet thing.
It gets a little weird around this area. Because there's multiple levels to every area. Oh. I might be underneath here. It might be the next level. Or I or I don't know where. Or a higher level. I'm gonna pick some of this up. Send me to the same place. Oh, I see it. I see it. Okay. All right. This one. Guardian wings. There's one more though. I got it already. What I want to go back and read it. Guardian wings. I know you are out there across the divide. I see you scanning the skies at night. I wonder what it is you search for. I would ask you directly. I've been told not to approach. Rumors suggest you prefer to live in solitude. I will respect that. And I hope that your search, whatever it might be, proves fruitful. And I will keep my eyes set in your direction. Every now and again, just to reassure myself of your safety. We must look after one another. After all, is the way of dragon kind. Hmm. Huh. I mean, maybe I'm reading it wrong, but it could mean that um, there was a dragon left behind. It wants someone left to search. So someone either left and didn't come back. I, I don't know. I don't know who it is. I could be misinterpreting that. Anyway, the last one... With Thaldrasis. It's called Caretaker Snoots. And it's in the ossuary. And I found it during the Blue Dragon quest, and I found it on the return trip. Ooh, what's this? I'm just opening this up to open it up. Because again, I have to pick up more dynamite though. There's nothing in here. I just. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, no, that's to get out. If you stay in here too long, you lock yourself in. There's like a little, a little, little gardening shovel that you're supposed to use to uh, dig yourself out. Yeah, I don't... There was nothing in here. I just saw the big wall and wanted to blow it up. <laughs> Alright, let's pick this up. I'm gonna get too distracted. I mean, this is kind of like a mini tour of the... Uh, of the Dragon Isles at this point. So I'm using a combination, oopsie, I'm using a combination of, uh, well, I, I'm using all of Wowhead. Uh, I'm looking at their site with their map as well. 
I mean, honestly, if I wanted to, I could probably put a little mini window with it somewhere on here. Um, hmm. Man, I honestly could. I really could. But, uh, let's just do this. It's always raining here. But the thing, again, with the ossuary is it's a dragging graveyard. Dragon Blight, I believe, took over when they had to leave the Isles. But, yeah, this is a dragon graveyard. They can die. They're not... The aspects are immortal. I don't think, even though they call you mortals all the time, we know from certain quest lines that they're not. That they are, they can die of old age. They can choose it, but they can die. Anyway, this place is downright melancholy. The skies are dark and gloomy no matter the time of day. They said I was here to learn responsibility, but I suspect they just put me here to dampen my spirits and make me behave like a proper dragon. Fine, then. I will fulfill my task, dutifully even. But they cannot stop me from having a bit of fun whilst carrying them out. Our dead should not have to spend their eternity wallowing in mournful tears. After all, they succeeded in the onerous task of, of living, did they not? I wonder if the wildlife here have the same magnetic attraction to my arcane sphere as the dead foliage that I gathered has. I bet that's worth an experiment. At the very least, I suspect any lingering ghosts we find will find the effort very amusing. Um, this caretaker notes the caretaker was Senegos. So this is written by Senegos. And that's why I had to come over and read it again out of respect. Um, and also out of respect I think it's the one all the way on top I think it's one of these two no. Senegos Bit of a spoil if you haven't done the Blue Dragon quest. Um, yeah. That's an excellent quest line. Um, you, you see it coming before it arrives. But when it does, especially if you play Legion. It's a lot, but it's it's a good form of a lot, not a bad form of a lot. So, from here, we'll start doing waking shores and working ourselves. I don't think I have any in the waking shores, any at all. But we'll start. We will start here at Wing Rest Embassy. Um, yeah. Two of these are at the Obsidian Citadel. So. We're going to be asked to do things that we don't want to do. <laughs> but we're not doing them. Because we have a mission. 
Uh, the first is learn and grow. Which should be, I think it's over here somewhere. For some reason it's not putting the uh, markers on the map, but that's fine. Um, I just follow the arrow. At some point, I gotta do the. Oh, this area. This makes sense. Um, I l somehow miraculously accidentally landed on a tree branch. You know, I should have pretended I meant to do that. Because <laughs> I, like, flew right into it and it was perfect. Um, yeah, I meant to do that. That, that, wasn't, that wasn't purely a coincidence. All right, let's go. I don't think I've ever went to any of these areas. Because I didn't feel like fighting. That's why. There are a lot of- Oh, oh, are you kidding me? <laughs> what the heck? I was like, oh, these are easy. They'll go down. And then they freaking kicked me. Oh. It's the, it's the freaking drag there, man. Yeah, I gotta turn my back to a wall. Alright, so they have a pushback, and that pushback nearly got me killed, and that wasn't fun. Alright, let's go inside here so anything that attacks me. Oh, come over here. Come over here. There's a bird in here. There's no stone in here, but there's a bird in here. I think there is a thing for this. I think that's part of an achievement, but we'll just do that for now. Um, there is a, like, take a picture with certain birds thing. It's too far away. I'm out of range. Yeah, that's strong gust. Don't like, th I like it when I'm on a drag deer, but I don't like it when I'm not. So it wasn't in that one. I'm going flying right inside. They didn't even notice me. Not in here. Nothing's in here. All right. We can row because we're a rogue. It's right here in the middle. Right here. Really? I need to get closer. Fine. It's too far away. Okay. Can I thank you? Read in peace. Um I am no longer a student, learn and grow. I am no longer a student. But I find myself returning here regardless. My days are spent guiding our young from shell to hatchling, safeguarding the precious generations to come. But my evenings are spent here. The sun is particularly beautiful from here. The stories we have captured enthralling, the art inspiring. Truly, this is a place in which we learn to mature our young. But it is also a place where we can nurture our own interests as well. Perhaps the Dragon Queen intended this all along. A sanctuary where we can continue to learn and grow no matter our age. This location, by the way, is on the Lifebinder Observatory. It's one of the few places that's completely in ruin. Well, not completely in ruin. Still remarkably preserved given it's over 10,000 years old. But, but still... 
like it's at least lacking roofs in places. At least things are on the ground. You still have a bunch of neatly stacked books. Books. That in no way did the pages rot in all these years. Yes, we could just excuse it all. It's magic. Magic did it. Magic is responsible. They use magic to preserve, uh, to preserve, 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 blah, 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 preserve books. All right. The next one, I mean, it's kind of a zigzag. One, two, three, four. I'm going to do the two near the Obsidian Citadel last. Um, this one is so close so far. I think I can actually just copy them all. <laughs> all right. So we got I should pick up more more boomy boomy sticks and uh boomy sticks <laughs> go the dragons <laughs> boomy stick boom sticks um dragon skill expedition pick up more dynamite oh here it is it's right here okay I, I ran by it about a million times, but it's right here. This one's so close so far. Shall I tell you why I watch the stars? It's a lot of squawking in the background. Shall I tell you why I watch the stars? They are distant. They keep me company, like memories of loved ones. The lives below cry with persistent noise and clamor. A sharp contrast to the silence of absent friends. When I meditate beneath the heavens, I imagine lines drawn between these distant points of light. Familiar faces all. Each new discovery I make is named for a loved one I have lost. These bright sparks lessen my grief. Atop the spires of my observatory, I may be quiet. I may be unattended, but I am never truly alone. Well, that's nice. Next one is Book of Me the First. Though I did want to go to, before I do that, I want to um, go back to the embassy. Or actually, I can just go back to the original, the landing point. Shouldn't take me too long. I'm just gonna zoom it. I think it's here. Yes, it's right on. Here. So I think you have to actually. Come, let us parlay. Amelia Bella. What are you doing here? Many of these statues are quite valuable, but in disrepair. We collect the pieces that break off and safeguard them from looters and symphony hunters. If you find anything loose, pry it off and bring it to us. We'll keep it safe until a proper restoration effort can be undertaken. So I think this opens up finding certain treasures. Do check back for new stock, friend. Show me what you have for sale. I already have that. 
<laughs> Look, it's just, it's just, it's, uh, it's purely cosmetic. Um. Come back anytime. You got my attention. So I think that starts. I think you need that in order to collect certain gems that are part of like the the dig thing. Um, I, I, yeah, you know, you use the shovels for the dirt piles. All right, now we'll go to where we should be going. I wasn't sure if I got that on our layer yet. And I wanted to be sure because I do want to finish that. There's two appearances that you need a soulbound gem on. And she hasn't find... It was Titan. I had to get it. You know, it's Pokemon, but whatever. Um, oh, I forgot to shoot. I didn't overload it. Oh, okay. So even if you don't overload it before you pick. Titan Touch Portal. It's going to take me somewhere else now. Oh, good. It has a return portal because I was going to say. Sometimes, sometimes the return portal doesn't show up. All right. So where were we? I also need to visit. I also need to visit the um, the frog. I think I have enough to buy the sunglasses and start the art of thing. Okay. So, oh, right here. Oh, okay. When you first come to this one, there's a whole quest around it. Um, yelping some dragon can and um, it, it's it's a cute quest I don't want to ruin it but if you come here then when you read this it just says it looks like it's waiting for something I guess I can read it now yep I can read it now cool the first whelp arrived in a, in a in a joyous display of ceremony a parade of dragons gathered along the eye ivy-clad trellises to greet the young one. The egg belonged to a humble red dragon who supervised the temperature of our life pools. Who better to determine the right amount of heat than a mother? She gently breathed the fire until the ambience was just right. When the blessed moment came, she lovingly awaited her child, as, as did the gathered assembly. Silence surrounded her until the shell finally cracked. The tiny triumphant sound elicited a cheer from the gathered throng. Even now, the joyous display and echoes the joyous display echoes in my heart. I remember the dragon queen bowing her head, tears in her eyes. Not of sadness or sorrow, the joy of a purpose at last fulfilled. I mean it assumes there were dragons before, but it, I it's I guess it's the first egg that hatched in the Ruby Life Pulse. I wonder if this was the mother. I wonder why it's by this dragon. Oh. So we got the they're flying around the circle. Well, I mean that's that's just just freaking lovely. All right. The last two are at the Obsidian Citadel, and they're Nilthara Stands. I think I have read that one. And no, I didn't. I haven't read any of the not not on this character. And then one small part is another one. So um, Nilthara Stands is the closer of the two. Yeah, 
allegiance to one is a it's like it's a it, I haven't done it in months um, but it's up so for, so that will be something we get to hear wait let me check something disturbed dirt that's what I was like the dirt stuff the dirt stuff. I think I have enough shovels. Seven charges, twenty. Yeah, we're good. It's a lot of derb, disturb, derb, 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 derb. <laughs> that's, that's it's here. Derby, derb, derb. Is that disturbed dirt too? Yep. Don't want to bother getting it. It's like, I'm right here. I don't see it. Oh, here it is. I got, I got an appearance I already have. Awesome. <laughs> I can put it on, um, I can put it on the auction house. Let's see if there are any buyers for it. For the, for the folks who don't do this. I didn't put in the... I don't think I put it in yet, did I? Altharis stands. Alright. Right. Jordan, continue to threaten our position here. The Black Dragonflight welcomes your help in repelling these attackers. Though I have been, perhaps, difficult at times, we've always worked together. I am sure you will continue to support my efforts for the betterment of Azeroth. Oh, uh, I'm like, why are these people? Why are there? Why is there a crowd here? And I realized, oh, right, 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 right. The Mystic Keystone, Mythic Keystone is doing. Nilthoris is one of them. All right, so this stone here is Nilthoris stance. Nilthoris stance. Behold, the bulwark of the Dragon Isles, Nilthoris. Any who would threaten the land of dragons will first have to contend with its finest defenses. Our numbers are great, our weapons are greater still. Whether it be by claw, breath, or blade, our enemies will fall. Let this place serve as a warning and grave to any who would be mad enough to test our prowess. For this is our oath, to protect the deep places of the world, to protect the world itself, to protect our kin. We will see dragonkind prosper until our watchful eye under our watchful eyes and warding wings. So that didn't work out originally, but they're, they're, they're trying to work on it now. They're trying to, trying to make up for it. Uh, remove waypoint. And this one should be the last one. This is um, one small part. And this will give us the achievement for the waking shores. Where is it? Okay, it's really close. Up there? Unless I need to go inside, which would suck. I'd rather not. I think I might have to. I mean, I can survive it better than I can when I was grinding this area, that's for sure. Shoot. It's supposed to be right here? 
I bet it's inside. Unless it's all the way up here. But I know I've been up here like a million times. I'm thinking it's inside. I have to go under. Because ah, I can't get any closer this way. In we go. Haven't been there in a while. Why not? Oh, I think I know exactly where it is, too. I think I know where it is. I've never clicked on it for so Or I may have clicked on it when it still wasn't, I was still wasn't able to read it. when it still wasn't possible to read it. And this is why I like being a rogue. Because I can do all kinds of roguey things and not have to fight and get into battles. That kind of sucks. So I can sneak around. I think I see the stone from here even. Sometimes there is um, a rare. And that would have that sucked. But... It seems I am lucky. And the stone's right here. And yeah, I've seen the stone a million times in doing the runs here. And this one's called One Small Part. And I should get the achievement. All right. I only asked... Ooh. <laughs> okay. Goes right in it, doesn't I only asked aloud about Father once. If the obsidian throne is his, why is he not here to rule from it? Had it been anyone else, I would have been cuffed for my impertinence. Instead, she only narrowed her eyes. One does not rule by sitting on a rock. But I have not seen him in months, I protested. You do not matter, she hissed. The flight is what matters. You are merely a small part of a greater whole. One that, she noted with another glare, is testing my patience. I no longer question. I do not wish to be I do not wish to displease him. One small part. Perhaps in due time I can be more. Now who it's I mean we know it's referring to Neltharian. Um, but who is it from? It could be I mean it could be Sibelian even. Um but it could be Nefaris, it could be Anixia, it could be you know, any any of the dragons that he's a he was a direct father of. I don't think it's Abyssian. I think Abyssian is actually younger than the dragon. I think he was. I don't think he was born on the Dragon Isles. I'm not even sure Sibelian was. I hope at some point they actually bother to explain all this. How old these dragons are. Because it seems like Sibelian is older than Abyssin, but Abyssin I think is 10,000 years old. 
I don't know. In any case, well, I meant to do this without getting into fight. I don't want to jinx myself though. But I had a feeling I was like, I there's a stone down there. It it's that one, and I've definitely tried to read it while doing the um, the key runs to get the keys for the um, the rep. But um, but yeah. Oh, I didn't have uh, I didn't bring um. Oh, it doesn't matter. I've, I've, I've have. It's she has no reaction whatsoever, Luciana. I was kind of hoping she would like. She'd be like, "Oh, cool, this is cool," and like just look around. I have stuff to say to uh, the two toots on top. So, waking shores is done. Um, we are going to do. Onarin Plains next. Onarin Plains, I guess we should start from the first Kronal. I actually... I actually... Okay, that this is not helpful. <laughs> Let's just do that. I was it, there was the option to it says copy all, so that's what I was going to do. But I'm just going to uh, do them each individually. Oh, I did want to stop in Dragon Scale Expedition. And I have to stop at the Great Swag. I want to try to remember that. But these are not quests I didn't do. These are quests that they're like wanted daily rep stuff. Um, right, right. Archivist request. Yes, it's, it's one of these. Ruby life band. I know I did it. I'm not going to worry about that now. I know I've done that. Yeah, I've done these. I've done these. Time is money, friend. Alright. Um, I was coming in here to buy goodies. Good day to you. Oh, apparently. Safe passage to you. Ahoy. Uh, do I actually really have I guess I do. I I meant to send that to someone else. Anyway. Let's get some more of this. Ten. Ten seems good.
I don't know what this is, a quafting, quacking quafting region. Um, I use currently, I'm, I just have my uh, blacksmith make more because they're four as opposed to getting these, which are five, so it takes up less bag space. Um, there is, what don't I have? I don't have the green Ramoni. That's I have the stuff for it, I just have to bring it over. Um, it's in script. These are recipes. And I don't have the um, skinny reliquary pillow, which requires tattered waddle cloth, spool of waddle dyed, and 100 dragon owl supplies. I should just remember to come over here at some point and get those. Oh, and the skitterbug. Which again, I just need to remember to bring this shit when I visit, come here. Anyway, not gonna worry about it now. We are going to go to the owner in planes. Do also, I should also drop in on uh, what's her face and hand in my crafting stuff. Okay, we're almost there. Almost there, almost there, almost there, almost there, almost there. By the way, ground skimming does not require you, require you to skim that closely, which is only something I've recently discovered. All right, here we go. And this one is called the first kunai. Colonel. First Colonel. I'm not sure how it's pronounced. Tira was the first Kanamatra. Over her lifetime, the division of our people became more pronounced, threatening the tentative pact we made with the Green Ones. To prevent more division, she called the first Kunal. In this, she did more than unite families, she united the clans. Those of the first Kunal were wary. The words they spoke to honor and celebrate were new. They had no ritual to follow. Like newborn foals, they teetered into the silence and filled it with ceremony. Each year, that ceremony was renewed. Leaders repeated old rituals and speeches, building tradition. The first Kunal now serves as a lesson for us all. Trust must begin somewhere, often with a single act. From one grandmother's trust and love, our union was made. That's cool. Next one. Um, next nearest one is the Knoll Wars. And it's in a cave. up here first because I need to turn in I need to turn in um I remember having the hardest time trying to remember where this cave entrance was the first few like mm. month what do I have for you so I have one of I each I eagerly await our next train Come back with right. more coin. I'll give one each. I will hope for your swift return. Great, awesome. Whatever. Let's go. Um now we will proceed. What herb is that now? So yeah, um skimming I think only needs to be about there. 
There is so much to document in the Onarin Plains, Hero. Another photographer is always welcome. Sorry, Corley. I'm busy. Yeah, honestly, the Onarin Plains is really one of the few places you can do it, right? It's in a cave. Here we go. There's a lot in here. There's only one you can read. Interesting. Okay. The Null Wars. When we first arrived in the Unaran Plains, we were not alone. Knolls lurked in the shadows, grinning with malice as I set their snares. Arahuna, soaring overhead, watched their migration. Onara's winds carried mocking laughter to us. When the children of Maruk and Tira first faced those foes, the gnolls tested their, their patience. They fought with fury and hatred, as if they had nothing to lose. Inevitably, we pushed, we pushed them from the plains. We lost many, but they lost more. But if you see a single gnoll, be wary. Where there is one, there are always many more. Oh, and don't I know it. <laughs> Do not let them surround you. Drive them out. Show them there is no land, no prey, no room for their kind here. Yeah. Gnolls and murlocs have the same annoying habit of, like, you will pull every single one. Um, so that one is the Gnoll Wars. We're going to do Wind, Wood, Water next. I figured it was on this island. See, here it is. We have a Briskwater Otuk. <laughs> and just chilling out on this rock. And I should be able to read this. Or not? Why can't I read it? Oh, it's on this side. Okay. <laughs> it's like, it's right here. Wind, wood, water. Long ago, a grieving mother lost her only child. She followed his funeral procession to the eternal Kurgans. Distraught, she cried all day and all night beside his brutal, brutal besides his burial mound until she collapsed in mourning. When she awoke, it was with surprise and shock. For she was lying in the shade of a massive tree that had grown overnight, its bows outstretched to Anara's skies. Beside her, clear water had gathered in a, s in a small pond. The winds had carried her grief to the ancestors and touched them to respond with gifts to soothe her aching heart. This place endures here still. The shade and water offer comfort and solace to those that come to the Kurgans to grieve. Even in our deepest sorrow, we are never truly alone. That looks nice. Alright, next one. Dreams in Emerald.
I think I found it. Yep, there it is. Not bad. Dreams and Emerald. The gardens first called to me in my dreams. In pleasant moments of light slumber, my mind wandered, envisioning the vast forests of the Emerald Dream. Isera sensed my fascination. Somnicus, she said, you will be the first caretaker of the garden. In ritual, I contemplated Isera's portal between that languid realm and our own. I am no sage, no mage. My scales are green, not blue. Yet my mind shown me the way, revealing my path to the Emerald Dream. In the waking world, the seeds of a great forest sprouted and thrived and soon towered over the place where I dreamed. The trail I blazed has always been sacred to me. In the depths of my dreaming, the garden awaits. The gardens await. Somnicus. He's the, isn't he the old guy? The old one? I can look for him now, but I may pass him because the next one is in the same roundabout area. Which is called Your Dreamer. And this will round out Onarum Plains. Though I do need to find the Great Swag. I think he's over here somewhere. Which is not convenient. Which makes me think I should have done this in the other direction. Oh, I guess it's over here. I was like, I wonder if it's in that other area. That makes sense. Nope, it's not. It's over here. Theramus. Hey, Theramus. Have I spoken to you yet? All paths begin in the dream. It's good to see you, friend. Do you suppose we shall meet again? I don't remember him. I, I don't remember him. Where do I know Theramus from? I gotta look him up. <laughs> he called me friend. That makes me think he's one of the ones we've dealt with before. No, apparently it's unique to this. Okay, he's part of, he is part of a quest line. I did deal with I did I did Yeah, he was part of a quest, so anyway. Here we go. This is the last one. Your dreamer. This is the last one for, uh... <gasps> the last one for the achievement. So here we go. Boom. Let's know. I'm trying to read it. Theramus. I had hoped to leave word with you directly, but this will have to do. The aspects and I are needed elsewhere. For how long, I cannot say. Something threatens this world. Not even Malago seems to know exactly what we are facing. It seems in this we fly, we fly blind. Watch over this place, dear one. Keep it safe, both for the dream and for me. I'll return soon enough. Hopefully in time for the new bloom. We shall plant evermore together. Your dreamer. I mean, it does beg the question of, was, did he stay behind? Because you knew a dragon, you get, you know that dragon can stay behind and dragon can stay behind. You know, you know, some did, you know, they didn't all leave. Um, it seems Theramus. Stay behind? 
Or maybe it was a matter he was in the dream, so it didn't matter? I don't know. You got the impression no dragons were on the Dragon Isles this whole time. But I don't know. There's, there's just a lot of things. I don't know. So I think all I need is Azure Plane now. Uh, but let's talk to these two dryads. The forest welcomes your return. What is nature's call? You must protect all from the humble followers to the ancient oaks. It's like strange mushroom, I should eat it. Welcome to Ardenweald. 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 We're not in Ardenweald. We're not in Ardenweald. Alright. I gotta reread that story and refresh my memory what it was about. I think there is a there is an achievement for sleeping next to all the the sleepy greens. But I forget. So Well, let's remove the arrow. I was going here to pick flowers. That's all. Alright, so... I need to find the great swag. I'm just coming here to put my poison on Claudia. That's not it. I know. I'll find it. I'll find the great swag. I should just look it up and stop doing this to myself, right? I know it's around here somewhere. Oh no, 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 no. Damn it.
I was hoping to remember where it was. But it's a... I think it's a... It's around here. I'll look it up. I'm doing this myself. Yeah, I'm a little too far in one direction. But I'm, I'm close. I'm close. I had a feeling it was on the little island. No, he's just a big swag. He's not the great swag. Um... You're in the right area. Not there. The turtle there, though. Hey, turtle. Oh, look, there's a whole bunch, little bunch of little turtles. Cool. Where am I? I'm glad. I'm glad I have my Kellowick fishing pole. See, now I'm in Azure Span, which is wrong. Uh, I'm getting the Tom Tom commands for this. This is for the Great Swap. This is not for, uh, not for the last stones of the Azure Plane. Azure Span, which we will be going to next. But I need. Oh, was I right? Yeah. Oh, it's right. Okay, here it is. Great Swag. Hey, Great Swag. Now, if I'm right. For, wait, what? So, my dilemma at the moment is, oh no, I'm not, he doesn't buy anything, I guess. You can, I cannot sell items to him. So, I have 14 copper coins of the Isles, and I have three silver coins. Uh, okay, I 